you can use podcasts in order to um, learn English quite easily. A podcast allows you to view and listen to lessons with or without Wi-Fi. You can listen without Wi-Fi if you've downloaded episodes already onto your mobile device. I'll show you how to do that. Uh, also, it, they're quite helpful. For example, if you take a trip somewhere and it's a four-hour driving trip, you um, want to listen to something besides music on the radio. This allows you to listen to things while you're in a car, while you're on a bus. You just put your headphones on and you watch the um, podcast. Some podcasts are video, some are just audio. So here is the way that you can find my podcast. In this Podbean app, this is the app I use the most. It's free. It's, called, it's spelled P-O-D-B-E-A-N. You download it, and when you press the app on your phone or on your mobile device, this format comes up. You go to the magnifying glass at the top, you type in English, and mine is right here. You simply press that, and it comes out with the videos available. An important thing here is this button. If you want to subscribe to the channel or follow the channel, you press this button, and it will f you'll follow it. And I'll explain that in a minute. But the videos from the website that I have are all loaded here. Now, for example, um, this one is called the Halloween Special. I can download that onto my mobile device wherever I have free Wi-Fi. To download that video, I simply go over here to where there's these three dots. I press this. Whoops. And here you see the download button. I don't know if that's easy for you to see, but it says download. You press this and it begins to download that episode. You can download, you know, 5, 10, 15 different um, um, episodes that you want because you can always erase them later and I'll show you how that's done. So this is downloading an episode that I'm interested in. How do you access that later? Well, when you're back at your home page, when you first come into the app, because you have followed the this particular podcast, if you go to this area here and touch it, for example, these are all the podcasts that I follow. Now, if I want to see which ones I've downloaded, I simply press here. And the videos that I have downloaded are shown. If I want to play this video, I simply press it. Once again, you're not using any um, data because it's already been downloaded. So if you don't have Wi-Fi, like in a bus or when you're walking or sitting out in nature somewhere and you want to view, view it, you can view it. Um, I've turned the sound off here. But this goes through the, the pictures that I use that I ask questions and I allow time for you to act, answer the question. So there's usually about 15 different questions, 15 different photos and related questions to those to those. Um, particular photos. The one bad thing about a podcast is that there are no captions. You cannot access the caption um, feature. You could only do that on the website where the actual this actual YouTube comes out and you'll be able to access the captions. So there's if I wanted to review this later where I ask questions and I leave time for you to answer, to practice your English skills, um, you have an avenue to do that. After you've seen the, the video, you can delete it. How do you delete it so that you freed up space on your mobile device? You go over here to the three dots, 
You press it. There's a remove download button. You push that and this video disappears. It frees up space on your phone. So once again, if I want to look at my downloads, when I come to the here, we go right to this button, go to the downloads, and all the, the episodes that I've downloaded in the past are on my mobile device, and I can access them without Wi-Fi. Um, if I want to stream, I can stream live also by just going into the app and it will give me, I can stream live if I have Wi-Fi. So this is the download function. It's, um, it's a simple way to practice English by yourself to build up your English skills because I'm asking the questions and you answer. It's helpful if you first go to the website and see the format to see which video you want. Some have picture photos, some do not have photos um, that you use. So, um, once again, podcasts is a great way to learn English. And Podbean, this podcast app, will get you right to the podcast I make. Thank you.